Hello friends and welcome to yet another lecture on chemical engineering thermodynamics. Today we will study the application of Raoult's law. We will use Raoult's law to calculate the bubble point and the dew point pressures. I am Professor Arvind Prasad. Let's take the problem. The binary mixture of benzene and ethylene chloride forms an ideal solution, one that obeys Raoult's law at 49.99 degrees Celsius. Find the bubble point and the dew point pressures for Xb is equal to 0 0.5. For a temperature of 49.99 degrees Celsius, the saturation vapor pressure for benzene and ethylene chloride are given. Pb is the saturation vapor pressure for benzene and Pt is that of ethylene chloride. Now let's understand the idea of bubble point and dew point pressures. If we have a liquid which is under pressure, now at constant temperature if we start reducing the pressure on it, bubble point pressure is the pressure where the first droplet of vapors form in the pool of liquid. Now if we further reduce the pressure, the liquid is going to vaporize. Further down, reduction in pressure is going to be a superheated vapor. If at constant temperature, we increase the pressure on the vapors, dew point is that point where the first droplets of liquid form in the vapor and further increase in pressure will end up giving more and more liquid. Now let's solve the problem. We know that the benzene concentration is 0.5. The ethylene chloride concentration is equal to 1 minus the concentration of benzene. That is because it is a binary solution. The saturated vapor pressure of benzene is 0.357 and the saturated vapor pressure of ethylene chloride is 0.357. Now at bubble point pressure, the concentration of liquid is 50% benzene and 50% ethylene chloride. So if we apply Raoult's law, we will get the pressure as the concentration of benzene in the liquid multiplied by the saturated vapor pressure of benzene plus the concentration of ethylene chloride multiplied by the saturated vapor pressure of ethylene chloride. So just a moment, I need to make a little correction here. And there we are done. As we see, the pressure is 0.336 bar. Now, at dew point, the vapor phase concentration of benzene is 0.5. By application of Raoult's law, so 
So let's run all this once again to set things right. Yes. Now, by application of Raoult's law, we know that the concentration of benzene is going to be equal to the pressure into the concentration of benzene in the vapor phase divided by the saturated vapor pressure of benzene. We also know that the concentration of benzene in the liquid phase plus the concentration of ethylene chloride in the vapor phase will be equal to 1. So, what do we have? We have 1 equal to the pressure at the dew point multiplied by so let's first fix the concentrations so y benzene in the vapor phase is going to be 0 0.5 and y ethylene chloride in the vapor phase is going to be 0 0.5 which is going to be nothing but 1 minus y benzene in the vapor phase now we can write the equation as 1 is equal to P dew point star Y benzene divided by plus P at the dew point multiplied by Y ethylene chloride divided by So, this equation now gives us the dew point pressure. Now, let us solve the resu resulting equation to get the dew point pressure. And what do we get? Let us see. Zero point three thirty four bars. As you can see here, the value of three point 0.334 bar which is roughly here and the bubble point pressure is 0.336 we can find that the dew point pressure is lower than the bubble point pressure okay so this was how we calculate the bubble point and the dew point pressures using Raoult's law fine guys have a great day and do subscribe and like my channel. Goodbye.